All right, folks, um, before I welcome you back to the Let's Play, on the previous episode, I missed a treasure chest in the Ice Pyramid. Or two episodes ago, whatever it was. So you go through here through a secret passage, and you get some arrows. All right, I just thought I'd show that off because I forgot to last time. All right, be back in a minute. All right, folks, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Now, I forgot to save my game after the whole uh, episode last time around because I had to go through the Ice Pyramid all over again. And that's why I was able to show off uh, that hidden treasure, or the missing treasure from last time. I noticed it when I was watching the YouTube video playback. Um, anyways, so also off camera, I went ahead and got nine out of the ten battlefields battles fought. So we're going to fight one round per battlefield so I don't have to do so much editing. All right, so starting here, let's, which is, by the way, just north of the uh, Eward Temple there, which is near Aquaria. All right, so let's go, folks. And get the strike first, so that's that. Yay, we get... The exit spell. Ooh, that would have been nice last time around. Um, yeah, so these first several battlefields you were meant to do by yourself, but you don't get any penalty um, with Reuben in your party, so why not? You'll get any experience penalty, that is. So let's kill a snow crab or freezer crab or whatever it's called. It's crab meat now, folks. And I get 744 experience points. Oh, yeah, and then that way it doesn't take you anywhere. So, let's go back to the fire area. And, yeah, also off screen, I got a whole bunch of explosives. Oh, yeah, that was, never mind, that was the case um, with the previous video file we had, too. So, I guess that wasn't a big deal. I loaded up on explosives before. Yeah, because the Ice Pyramid, second time around, I was down to nothing hardly in explosives. So, anyway... Here we go with one left to go. And we get a jelly. All right. Um, reminds me of Bill Cosby doing jello commercials. And we get 900 gold. Yay. And let's. All right. So that, that dude's dead. This dude's dead, and we get the Gemini Crest. All right. And now we need that Gemini Crest. Da 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 da. Platman. Yeah, I'm strong against paralyzed attacks. So you can't paralyze me. Oh, yeah, like I told you before, Ruben's. Mace is considered a um, axe-type weapon. We get 816 experience points for that. Yay! There's Fireberg. Let's clean out these guys real quick. One more to go. You are expected to have two party members here, so... Ah, darn. And I get attacked with a fang. And I'm paralyzed. They are. Let's show off the blizzard spell. Get a couple of snowmen or snow dragons in this case. Man, they're just all after Reuben here. All right, you're dead now. I win 1,200 gold. Yay!
And the last one, ooh, these little guys, red caps. Or these guys, and yeah, let's just get a blizzard spell, because why not? You're dead. And he's weak against water, and you're dead. Yay! I win the thunder spell, my first wizard spell. All right, before we go any further, let's go to Fireberg. All right, I know you got more money for seeds now. Um, 78, 21 is 99, so there you go. Yay. I just love this funky town music here. A refreshment guaranteed. I love that. That's because I just want to heal up those magic spells I used. Um, I don't remember where it is. No, it wasn't in here. But we get three refreshers that we don't need. Um, okay, okay, get out of my way. I know we spoke to you guys already, so. Okay. Alright, here's a Gemini crest. Let's see where it takes us. Ooh, this sounds familiar, this music. Ooh, let's rob some more refreshers that we don't need. And we're back in Aquaria! Alright, so yeah, these things can kind of warp you around the world a little faster going from town to town here. So we're back in Fireburg. I just wanted to show that off. And I forgot to show off one more thing in here. See that um, treasure? How can we get there, you might ask? Well... You go down this way. Yee, Geronimo! And you get a little secret passage. Yay! It gets you three more heal potions. I forgot to show that off last time too, folks. Sorry about that. All right, next destination. If you remember from last episode, um, Ruben's dad was trapped in a mine thanks to that boulder in the top right hand corner of the screen, and we have to go free his dad. So let's go help him. I don't like this dungeon. So you have a lot of one way passages. You see these, uh, these uh, conveyor belts, they go in certain directions. Like, I can't go that way. I can't even... Oh, I just... And then you also have these buckets. Like, the little pulley buckets. There's only one-way traffic. You can't go up them. So, you have to plan your routes carefully. And I'm gonna... Alright. Red Bones! He's dead? Not dead. Or any tax with the sword, not too bad. Alright, and yeah, let's blow this thing up. Oh, yeah, the jump. Alright, so. Ooh. We get eight enemies here. Nice grinding material here. Yeah, let's go with uh, the dragons. So we have 99. Um. Freaking seeds. Let's go take care of these dragons. Yay! And let's, yes, Ruben is strong against fire attacks. That's good. And last time I forgot to mention when we picked up Ruben that, um, Ruben. This is our last party member we will be, guest party member we will be grabbing. Whoops. Come on. Hmm. 
Oh no, double confusion, that's no bueno. Oh. Alright. Hypno sleeve. Sounds like you want more blizzard. Oh snap! You almost killed me, Reuben. Okay. That's how you want to play red caps? All right, first time we've seen mummies, zombies. I thought there were mummies. I don't like those red caps. All right, you're dead. Oh no, well, he's strong against paralyzed, so that does. Yay, go ahead and paralyze me more. Yay! Alright, let's see. We know there's uh, jumbo bombs. Look at that. He levels up. Yay! Get three more heal potions. Now let's go back around to Geronimo! Strike first. Me like you. Or you're dead. Y'all are weakened. Yay. Or you're dead. Alright, strike first. I like the sound of that. And um, here we go. Something I was noticing. Mark of the Beast there, 666 there. Now, a lot of people who aren't biblically inclined think that's like some evil omen. Now, if you read the word, you'll, you'll read a little bit differently. Um, but that's still not a good thing. Oh man, oh yeah, I'm strong as paralyzed. Oh, I forgot they can multiply themselves. Are they weak against fire or what? Not. Uh, well. Wasn't the strongest of spells, but it, it works. Yeah, Book of Revelation, they talk about how the Mark of the Beast are like, those are like the numbers. Like back in the day, you could like spell one, let's see, two. You could spell um, letters with numbers or something. And the name of the beast. Uh, that's supposed to be coming, who comes in deception and all that. Oh, go this way first. And his, uh, you'll know his name by his number, which is 666. That's all that means, folks. I'm trying to remember which way to go. Let's go, I think, um, this looks like the safer route. That doesn't take me anywhere, so... Or does it? No, it doesn't. Alright, so I want to go down here. I want to blow up that hole in the wall. Whee! Get two red bones. Two sets of red bones. Well, let's try the claw. Let's see if that gives any, um... And he's stas yeah, he's poisoned, see? Alright. You can poison him. We're gonna learn that today. Good. Alright. 
90. Okay, that's fine. Yay! Oh! Just defeat all these enemies here. Oh, nice. You're dead, and you're dead. No market of beast again. And 947. Oh, I can one shot those. Okay. And that takes me to nowhere. All right, Red Caps, I don't like you. Oh, if I can one shot these dragons now. Let's do this. But, you know, I've gained a couple levels since I fought those guys, and I wasn't one shotting them earlier. So I'll take it. Let's go. Boom. He's gonna like give me a paralyzed, but I'm um, immune to paralyzed, so I'll take it. Oh, what's in here? Oh, nice. We get a treasure chest. I don't remember what's in all these treasure chests, by the way. Red bones, yay. What do we get? We get the charm claw. Let's take a look at the charm claw, folks. It is still not as powerful as the sword or anything else I got, but look at all those status effects it does. It, in addition to poison and paralyze, you put them to sleep, you can confuse them, and I forgot what, I think that's blind there. Yeah, you can do all sorts of stuff with that. If you're not beating these guys with brute force, might as well give that a try. Anything else over here? That's coming the other direction. I've got only one choice. Let's go this way. Let's go beat some, beat up some mummies. All right. Be strong against poison. Strong against sleep. Strong against paralyzed. Well, that didn't do me any good, now did it? Alright, you're making me mad, Red Cap. I was thinking of bombing them for the multi-target, but if he's going to get them first, then that was kind of a waste. I know where I have to go, I just don't remember how to get there exactly. See, now I can throw those bombs and uh, chunk them. Alright, boom for you. Oh, and then a crit to 1927, almost our first 2,000 hit in the game. And a crit 1366. Oh, it was the year 1066 that um, Hastings was invaded with the Norman invasion. Yay. Let's try out the Charm Claw, see what it does to him. Well, whatever it did, um, they're dead, so. It tells you what they're immune against, but it doesn't tell you if they landed or not. That's a crit, and he's dead. Nice! else down here before I go up there? Guess not. Alright, let's kick this mummy's butt. Alright, you're dead. I missed you. Don't glare at me. Oh, 
I missed him again! I zapped myself with thunder! Almost killed myself! What the heck? I'm not suicidal. I might be crazy, but I ain't suicidal. And he missed it again! Finally, you're dead. And I zap myself and kill myself. Lovely. Alright. Um, at least that gets me out of, um... The old oh, yeah. Ruben is not a magic user. The only spell he gets is a life spell. Oh, he'll heal himself up. Yay. He needs it. At least he's poisoned. Oh, you're dead. Yay. Finally. Get six explosives for my trouble. Me, Geronimo. Okay. I have to go back up there. Just no reason to kill those enemies. Hmm. Yeah, it's late, folks. But just for experience, they're not guarding anything. So let's kill them. Are you dead? I know I can watch shot them with my axe, but I just wanted to see if it did any status effects. Nice crit. I did that before and it didn't do anything, so why am I still doing it? Oh boy. Alright, Lizard Spell, you want it bad enough. Y'all are gonna die. Alright. Let's just kill him off because I can. Uh, are you dead? Zombies are weak against it too. Nice. Didn't realize that, but I'll take it. Bad breath. All right, I'm gonna bomb y'all. Because Ruben's paralyzed. Yay! The only way we can go is back to the beginning of the dungeon! Or what's down here? Strike first? Gladly. And it's Christmas time! You're dead, and you're dead. Yay! Uh, nothing down there, so I don't know why I can go down there. I know where the boss is, but I want to make sure I go in all the, the holes and, um... And kill off all the enemies. That's what I meant to say. All right, y'all are dead. Yay! I know this is the way to the boss. That's why I don't really want to go this way. Well, I can't go that way anyhow. So yeah, maybe it's gonna. Take me around the roundabout way. Okay, good. Last blizzard spell. But I've got 99 seeds, so I don't care right now. Wish I had that last dungeon. Yeah, you don't poison for me. Yay. 
I miss anything up here? Yeah, I haven't been this way yet. Ooh. Still have a couple of thunder spells, so why not? You're dead. Zap. Zombies are weak against him, so he's dead. Alright, sweet. There's the boss right there. I don't want to defeat the boss yet. Alright, you're dead. Uh, zombie's gonna die next. And I get headbutted. Or Reuben gets headbutted. Actually, when I was a kid, I had a friend named Reuben. So there you go. Never had a friend named Kaylee or Phoebe. I have, did have a friend named Reuben. Or Tristan, for that matter. Our last thunder spell. Oh, well, oh, darn. Headbutt and oh, multiply itself. Mm. Oh, you're dead. Mm. And you're dead. Yay! So I'm not sure I killed all the enemies. And we went in there already. I think we may have, folks. Yeah, we're going in circles now. Let's go up there, just to make sure. I know I'm going in circles, so forgive me. Okay. Alright. Okay, let's go. Let's go to the boss. I think I have to kill everybody here. Yeah, because I've taken all these paths. And let's use a seed. Anything down there first? Oh snap. Crap. Uh, oh well. Just want to make sure. Yep, alright, that was not a big detour. Alright, sorry folks if I'm annoying some of y'all. Alright, let's go kick his butt. Alright, since so Ruben's not a magic user, let's go kick some butt. Alright, so I guess Thunder doesn't work too well. Alright. Good. Ooh, crit. That's no bueno. All right, Blizzard. Now I'm gonna cast life spell on Ruben. Red bulls are weak, but somehow the gin is not. Uh oh.
Oh no, I'm confused. No! Please say I hit the park them, yay. Oh no! Alright, well at least you did something useful. Oh no, I'm almost dead! I am dead! And the other me is still asleep, Mr. Ruben. I guess I had to wake up. Thank you. Oh boy. No! Alright, I'm sick of you. Hmm. No! Man! Well, we just gotta hit on the gin. And I'm dead. Okay, wake up. Life spell. No! Life spell. Yay. The river's dead. I'm getting my butt handed to me in this battle. What gives? And I don't have a life spell. Alright, I'm gonna solo this fight. I got a solo. <sighs> wow. Sheesh. This is the battle of attrition, folks. And I'm dead. No, I ain't giving up. All right, yeah, I went into this battle a little too, um, I thought Thunder was going to work, but no. Yeah, so you should do two Blizzard spells to knock out those red bones, I think. At least that's the plan. And... There you go. Now you gotta deal with... Cure and attack. Yay. Lucy wakes up. Oh, got his eye open and his mouth open. Yay. All right, let's keep going. Cure attack. Uh, oh, and a crit. I'm dead. All right. That means I can go back to Thunder Spell and attack. You're dead. Oh, not dead, but 586. Ooh, he's getting smaller going back into that bottle. Okay, cure and attack. Or miss. However you want to do it. All right, I can live with that. Thunder spell attack. Yes, you are dead. Now let's go through. Oh, look at all this. Five explosives. We got. Well, I can use a cure potion. Why not? Your potion. 
and heal potion. We're close enough to blow up the boulder. Let's blow it up. Stand back. Boom. Hey, I didn't take it from my inventory. Yay. Now the boulder rolls down and 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 down. We did it! I knew you'd save me. Please head home to mom. Right, you two be careful now. All right, Cag, let's return to Firebird. Well, you know what we picked up earlier in this episode? The exit spell. Let's get out of here. Yay! We haven't gone down here yet. What's down here? Sealed Temple. Oh, Mr. Guessing Prophet Guy. All right, what do we got? Out of 10 GP for a cup of coffee? What? Well, it's 100 GP if you're at Starbucks, but no product placement, folks. They are expensive. And where does this take us? The win oh, this is inside the Wintery Temple there in Aquaria we couldn't reach earlier. Heal potions. And Yay! It's a good place to spam heal potions if you want to do that. Alright! So next time, we're going to clear out this battlefield. And we're going to go into the volcano on Let's Play Final Fantasy Mystic Quest.